Hello everyone, welcome to another stream. We're live, oh, that's that's good. No, I thought it would take a little while because I've got the upload for patrons going on in the background as well. Um, I'm sure it'll maybe hinder performance a little bit having that going because the internet connection is only so, you know, obviously it clogs up a lot of bandwidth doing that. But it is uploading Patreon early access for the Mass Effect video. I'm, I've got to render it out to full quality for the, um, for the main post though. Like I could get it up. Um, I figured I could get it up sooner for patrons were at 30 frames per second instead of 60. Um, a 60 frame per second render of the full thing is going to take 10 hours. And I've still got to put, like, you know, the um, all the outro faff in, all the um, admin stuff, if you will. Oh, God. Why are you not beha Come on, behave. There we go. Okay. Um, right, here we are. Now, if, it, if we get any problems, then I don't know what we're going to do, but it shouldn't be a problem. It should be just fine. Tell me that we got 21% frames dropped, which is not good, but I suppose, I suppose that's whatever. Um, I guess that's 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 internet stuff. Is all I can chalk that down to. But it looks fine. Is the EA thing today? Yes, but in the UK it's at midnight, and you know what also happens at midnight? The Last of Us Part Two comes out. So you know what I'm not doing? Watching the EA thing. <laughs> How many times have you played through AC Origins? Like, through? Or just played in general? I can't count every single time I've fired up the game, man. But, I've played the game... I've played the game through a couple times. Look at this, this is gaming. I'm going to poo on the shelf. Well, that view count bumped up. Oh, we got some gamers chilling, that's fine. I can't wait for this Mass Effect video to finally go up and be done, though. Like, it's... The fact that we're nearly done with it is... Insanity. You know, like, that's, it's madness. James Rostron, you legend. I also saw Isak's super chat from earlier. Tell you what I'm gonna do, see if it helps with performance. I'm gonna close Vegas, because I got that in the background. Doing nothing in particular. I'm gonna work together this, um, little outro thing and then get it done. Man, I miss this channel. It's good to be back. Well, welcome back. Bye. I wasn't gone anywhere. It has been too long. It's been five Venus minutes. Is dead. I have gone to shit to get our son out of the duat. Hemu is at peace. May he walk in the field of reeds. I head to Rome too. Rome? You still entertain folly with these ambitions? I have made mistakes. You have made mistakes. Aya? You waste your energy. Ah. You are the famous Ah, uh, Brutus. Thanos never ceases to speak of your exploits. I have assembled a group. This is Brutus and Cassius, our Roman brothers. We're going to cut these bastards down from across the seas. Septimius and Caesar. The order is no longer an Egyptian problem only. Does Cleopatra still rule? There is no ruler in Egypt. Plunged into the will of various tyrants. Our queen has abandoned us for Rome. Nothing has changed here. Memphis is overrun by the Order. Aya, we need you. This is gaming. Bike went through poop. Yeah, he crawled through literal poop. Um, I suppose we're gonna do. I suppose we're gonna do the um, the origins ending, and then you know that's. Good thing. I don't know if I'll stream the opening couple hours of The Last of Us I Part 2. Like this. If I do, I'll have to figure out a spoiler. Of, a spoiler net. Cause so much pain. Maybe I'll just have to, like, you know, disable chat for a stream, but I don't want to do that. Oh, God, why is it not? That's why. Right. I don't want to disable chat for a stream, so that's another thing. But part of me wants to stream my first impressions. Um, I like the part where his kid died as well. I think maybe maybe I could direct um, people to the Discord and read chat from a Discord chat or something. Uh, uh, try to because I know that people will try to find proxy to even if I blacklist words, people will come in with proxy to try to spoil. I hate Cassandra because she looked like Ryder from Mass Effect. What fucking hideous and deformed. To be fair, Cassandra looked nothing like Ryder. My rider from Mass Effect Andromeda. Mine had green hair and purple lips and orange face paint and looked it 
my rider was a clown, basically. Can't remember what his what what the first name I gave Ryder, but it wasn't it wasn't Scott. You growing the beard? I have some beard here. I have some beard going on for sure. Speak to Aya one last time. The game really doing that to me. Oh my god, I got swiped by the lion. Ah. You like GTA games? Honestly, no. I don't. You're lagging. Am I lagging? Let's have a watch. Because I don't think I am. I'll take you to grow your mighty beard. From clean shaven a couple months and it's all good. No, I'm not even lagging. You're fucking chatting shit. Like, I'm... It's just odd. Yeah, no, why does someone always come in and go, LAG! I'm not even lagging. Maybe I will later. I'm uploading at the same time as streaming, so it makes some sense, but I'm not actually lagging. There we go. What's the best game of the current generation? Um, I think Red Dead Redemption 2. Yeah, it could be between that or God of War or um, The Witcher 3. Those are those. That would be my. I guess that would be my th like three choices. For what it does with the um, with this generation, I guess I don't really know. They all do something pretty fantastic. The Witcher is. The Witcher 3 is more of just like an RPG in the sense that, you know, it doesn't necessarily do anything groundbreaking for the generation. So I guess we can cut that one out based on that. It's a great game. One of the best I've ever played. Doesn't necessarily do anything for the generation. Um, Red Dead Redemption 2 is mad. This is the bit where we get the assassin insignia, boys. Our victories have multiplied. Our bond not so. We could never have been. Everything has told us our love is impossible. You are right. Something bigger has called us. But our love lives in the Duat. Only now we are letting go. Let the gods decide. The gods are dead. <laughs> God does not exist. Lasers is way better than this shitty channel. Okay. All this darkness was for a reason. I was wrong to be so reckless in public without killing. We must work in the shadows. Egypt has fallen. Greece also. And Rome will fall too. All will fall to the creed, yet no one will know. When we assassinate. You live for the Horizon sequel? I guess so, yeah. It. The few sick souls who try to control us. But they will never know who we are. Cold, calculated, poets of the kill. I am fine with this. I am not a father anymore. I am not a husband. I am not a Medjay. I am a hidden one. Now I get the uh, insignia from the eagle skull. The, the fuck are you typing? Mods, where the fuck are you? On the Discord. There we go. Just Kieran. Love your channel for she. Cheers, long fan. I appreciate that. That top five most dramatic breakups in Assassin's Creed. I like how we managed to get the ability point, but we can't apply it until after we've done everything now. Yeah. Oh no, not not Layla. Everyone's favourite gamer. They call her Layla Gamer Hassan. I should have listened to you. Oh, I've been deep. 
Those don't need to be your last words. Who the fuck are you? Well, they're not anymore, are they? Who the fuck are you is. Does the name William Miles ring a bell? And that's not even the last words anymore. Hello, you Zach. Know, right. How are you doing? We, the assassins, have been watching you. It's unusual for an Abstergo employee to take an interest in a country's revolution. You're not wrong there. We know about your work with the Animus. Astounding what you and Deanna were up to. D. They played you, didn't they? Sophia Ricken made you so many promises. Enough! We're not talking about her. Sure. Plenty of other subjects to cover on our ride to Alexandria. Don't assume I'm going anywhere with you. Well, let's look at your options. You can come with me, or you can stay here and do the dance of death again and again until you make a mistake. That's not John Delancey, is it? They only need you to make one. I mean, I'd, I can't... I'd, I, I keep getting torn between... No going is back this is this the same guy who did William Miles in 3 or not? I, I just don't think it is. But, but the credits say that it is. On like um, on IMDB or Our something. Of it. And with us, you'd always have the freedom to do things your way. Fine. Let's do this. That doesn't mean I'm on your side. Good enough. Um, I I kind of feel like that 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 cutscene was a missed opportunity, and the missed opportunity began when they killed off Desmond in Assassin's Creed Three. Can you imagine that scene if if we were still playing as Layla in Origins, but instead of William Miles showing up, it's Desmond. Can you imagine if that was Desmond who showed up to to explain to Layla why she can't you know do whatever she's doing alone? I think that would have been great, but you know what? Jesus Christ, that is an awkward position. What are you doing? Okay. Gaming time. I miss Vichy. Well, I'm not dead, so it's fine. I'm not dead yet. I mean, you. if you see me in public, I implore that you murder me. But until you do, don't. I'd actually rather that you didn't murder me, to be fair. You'd go to prison, and I'd be dead. And I don't, I don't much appreciate being dead. I wonder... This is this is one rapid fucking laptop, isn't it? See, that's far too many porn tabs for my taste. Now, return to the animals. I'd love to. What's that menu? It's um, it's the Assassin's Creed Universe operating system. I don't. I was going to come up with a joke there, but it had something to do with Windows. Is that for Foxy? Does a gift? No. It's a relic. I don't want to talk about it, Demastis. Isn't that Vyx? Let me have it. I'll give it to Foxy. Does myself. He loves these things. Imagine if she just stabbed him. I'll kill you. How about that? I'm in no mood for compromise today. What a naughty man. We passed Neapolis in the crack of morning. With strong wind, you'll be standing in Rome's forum in uh, two days' time. It's over between you and Bayek, eh? I can feel... No decision is easy. You are a chosen one. And now you are free! <laughs> like me! So begins a new day. There you go. I can't look at Aya, the fact she's related to Cassandra makes me upset. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah, it does, actually. It pisses me off. 
I forgot to mention this was nightmare difficulty this stream. Just so that you know that my 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 penis energy is through the roof. Um, Do you see? Don't drop your guard entirely. We should assume they are expecting us. You sound thrilled about it. Eager, old man. Eager to be done with this scum. And move on to the next pile of scum. Infinite That's scum. a gaming moment. Such is the world we live in. Need more speed. Pick up the pace. More speed. And what is the most Pick badass? The pace, is he? I will kill anyone who disrespects him. What? What? Besides from all the moments in the story where he doesn't kill people who disrespect him. Like Atabai. We have been spotted. Who has no respect for him. Because of what happened in Havana at the start of the game. So that that, that statement is just nonsense, let's be honest. Off tempo. Off the tempo. Pick up the pace. Here they come. Speed Forward, men. Look at the look at all these fucking aliens. Oh, that's how. Off you go. There you go. I'm doing my bits, don't you worry. I got this... I got the gaming deed doing... Whee! Where are these? There you go. Enjoy that cock face. There we go, Roman fleet is defeated. Speed off. Speed them off. Speed. They sent fighter ships upon us! Gods. Not fire ships. Oh my days. We are overwhelmed! These hell ships are too many! We must sink them before they reach us! They'll doom us if they strike us! Take them down! Fire ship front! Fire! Fire! Now! More fire ships close! What is it with these people and bastard fire ships? I just stop with the fire ships, man. We get it. You like fire ships. Do bits on the fire ships, gamer. So that was hard work. Bloody fire ship. That one's still going for it. Absolute lad. And you are going to sink in that. To be fair, I can't imagine it being any worse than the fire arrows that are being fired at us. They're not even ships, they're dinky boats. The kind of boats that buy exhales while on fire sometimes. You know, it, it, it sometimes rows these boats down the down the Nile and the fire and that. Well, I fucked that up, didn't I? Jesus. Have bombs. Have some of that cock. Oh, 
Sink the twin Romanopterims. Oh, fuck. We've still got this guy. We have this guy, we have... Oh, look at that. Well, this is a battle, isn't it? Of course there's another one. Yeah, and no, I forgot about that part. Having two... It's not that they get... They don't exactly get weaker as you take the health down, so you just have to focus on one, then take out the other. Whee! Like that. Why are they always firing at me, though? Why do they want me specifically? There are three. There are three triremes here. Choose whichever one is coolest. Also, why is this thing reversing? Well, I did not tell it to reverse, and I don't even realize it could. See that beautiful. It's me, the poo rat. Do 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 die. Raj in the bam hole. That did nothing, and now my ship is on fire. Okay. I guess the naval in this game is just not that difficult when you think about it. What's with the poop jokes? It's better than pedo jokes, trust me. Let's get to 100 likes. Form up with the rest. Today we sail together. What port are you taking us to? There's a town called Antium I'd like to try. Lots of merchants sail in and out of there. Should be safe for you. From there it's a half day's ride to Rome. I'm sick of this ship design. I want warships, not the same ship all over again. At least let us choose what ship we want to use. I'm so sick of the same copy-paste ship they put in every game. I'm sorry, but the uh, that ship is nothing like the Jackdaw. Uh, uh, but fair enough. It is only a matter of days before Caesar will officially become a tyrant. There he is. Ah, Caesar and Septimius. Caesar. You're a god. The Senate will not bow so easily. That parliament of clucking hands. Let me be your wolf. Septimius is a large bloke and he, should, he needs to stop. Also, why does he have... Why is there a chain? Well, it's, oh, it's his weapon, I guess. Do nothing until I get this in. Yeah, I don't understand. What is that chain doing? Because every boss fight needs to happen in an arena like space where there's no, you know, tactical advantage. Okay, you're gonna have to bear with me here, guys. This is a this is gonna be hard work because I'm not by. I can't one hit him. So Caesar is the king of the order now. Caesar is the father of understanding. You and Caesar will die. You are meddling with the affairs of the order. Order is greater than Rome. 
go back to Egypt with the rest of the liars and slaves. Just. I command armies. I control greatness. I will erase your order from the annals. Bam. Kneel to Caesar. Kneel to Rome. This is the part where he says Caesar is the father of understanding, and it actually doesn't make that much sense. You have no honor. You stole everything from me. I am a Gabignani. I thought you would scurry away, little one. You should have taken your chance to drop off the map. Flavius isn't here to save you. Why won't he fall over the dickhead? I forgot I had the bow, and the bow is a saving grace in a lot of these situations. Die, Septimius, you dickhead. Your mum stinks. And your granddad has Alzheimer's. Although it looks like he doesn't have much health, he still has more than I've ever had in this fight. Because nightmare difficulty, remember. There we go. He's done. I still don't understand why you said Timmy has golden chains. Yeah, they never explain that, do they? <laughs> Damn you, Lupa. My son's heart. For your life. Was revenge everything you hoped? You and the Medjai shall drench the sheets with your sweat tonight. <laughs> this stuff. With the order. I served them and your beloved Egypt. And I'll be rewarded in the afterlife. An eternity of drinking and whoring with my brothers. The only thing that waits for you is oblivion. For your name, your order, and the rotten corpses of your Gabignani. Up and devour your fettered heart. Ah, oh, now that was gaming. The beard, though. Exactly. Reach the Curia. Well, that's gaming. I wish I could toggle the hood as I have, but you just can't. Wait, can you? No, I don't think you can. You can never toggle the hood as I have, and it makes me sad. Like, just let me toggle the hood as I have. <sighs> Assassin's Creed Valhalla, but I have shows up just so you can toggle the hood. Right, don't forget to leave a like on the stream, share with your friends, hit subscribe if you're new, and. It's fine. I have a, I have, a, I have a foolproof tactic for this. J just skirt the lot. Right, let's go. In a straight line. Technically, this is a good tactic. All you do is you just go along like this, all the way round. I know you can't go on the roof here. That would make it so much easier. Because it does the classic Assassin's Creed of oh, these roofs have have spikes on them. You can't go up there. Because we didn't make anything beyond this place. And we don't want you to know that. So we can't convenience you at all. You just have to do things the hard way. Oh, you're a sudden 2020. Isn't it just so awkward how, um, I, while I is doing this, her ancestor Cassandra's just chilling in a cave somewhere. I'm sorry, it ruins the entirety of Assassin's Creed knowing that throughout every event that we've witnessed in the anima somewhere <laughs> in a cave, Cassandra's just chilling. It ruins the entire, the entire franchise. <laughs> and there's not a moment that you can watch knowing that Cassandra's in that fucking cave and not realise that it's ruined. It's just... It,
uh, Horizon Zero Dawn today. I'm looking forward to playing it. Yeah, it's a good game. It it does it's good fun. I mean, I've got to play the DLC still. I'm yet to do that. Wait, is Cassandra immortal? Well, she shows. Okay, she shows up in a cave in 2018 to pass the staff of Hermes to Layla. She's just physically there. She's been in that cave for 2,500 years nearly. And it's fucking ridiculous. The staff of Hermes prolongs her life like it did to a father Pythagoras. It doesn't necessarily not make sense. It's just absurdly stupid. I can't believe this is the method of getting across this courtyard that I've decided to take. She's just sitting on her ass in a cave. Exactly. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. And there's still, a ch I still have to get on the ground, so it it could still go balls up. But it's not likely. Cassandra in her cave with her 5,000 different love interests. Yeah, you reckon she, um, do you reckon the skeleton of the granny's down there chilling? Just like, hey, look, it's the, it's the granny skeleton. Cassandra made a suit to wear for the occasion, not once leaving the cave. <laughs> yeah, no, she just has a modern business suit on, and I don't understand why. But it is ridiculous. And she's just speaking English as well. Where did she learn English? Like, the Animus translates... As, so you know that study you know what's going on. The animus translates things, so they might sound like they're speaking English, but they're actually speaking a different language, and the animus is translating that to English for the user's uh, convenience. Well, Layla's not in the animus anymore. It's not me. It not me. Bloody hell. Fuck me. What a goon. No, what do you mean? Just shut them, shut the fuck up. Oh my god. Why did you do that, you absolute insufferable prick? If I die now, I'll be really pissed off because it takes like half a day to get across this fucking courtyard. Yep. Stop hiding behind that shield, you fucking coward. Ah, oh, fuck. Of course. Well, that looked really brutal, actually. Oh my god! Jesus, don't overdo it. I got right there and that fucking arsehole showed up. Oh, fuck's sake. It's not like the stealth in Origins is particularly refined. Fucking shit! Well done. It's not like the stealth in this game is particularly refined. Look, see, there's no chance of getting across here without being detected. And these guys just fucking damage sponges, because obviously, Aya is fucking shit. Yeah, stop stabbing the guy that is dead. This is fucking useless. I don't even have a shield, so I just have to sort of wing it. I, I just got clotheslined by the man's sword and it didn't even hit me. I just want to say, right, just for the record, that this is fucking poor level design. Because <laughs> Origins does not account for this sort of gameplay. However, I have a rough idea of what I must do. I must go around the other way now and hope for the best. Come on, move the right way. Cassandra's definitely a Facebook user. She writes shit reviews for places that she's not even been to. I guarantee that's the kind of Facebook user that Cassandra is. You get crap weapons, yeah, because everything's default. Like, everything is just shit. Sleep darts. Huh. Those weapons are closer to butter knives than daggers. Yeah, they're actually fucking useless. It's also a massive imbalance, because you spend all this time leveling up Bayek, and the ending is not even with Bayek. And you feel like, what's the fucking point? What did I... What did I work so hard to build Bayek up um, for? Skills-wise. 
Why did I bother? You know what I mean? That is genuinely the lot what I I felt. The Chad C1 imitation Kopesh. Well the the sad the Chad imitation C1 Kopesh, yes. The genuine imitation C1 Kopesh. I look at that number and think, fuck, can I be even be asked? I don't even have Senu to help me out. I have nothing. You have literally nothing. You just have to hope for the best, and it's such a fucking dice roll. Does anyone think that the parkour in this game isn't that bad? Well, it's virtually non-existent. It's not as bad as um, Odyssey, where you can't even hide in a haystack, or you know, you, you'll find. Okay, so there'll be two. There'll be two pit like rooftops close together, but in Odyssey. The character will jump down, like even if they're stupidly close, like say from this pillar to well from this part to that part there, for example. You know what I mean? That jump you just wouldn't make it in Odyssey. You just can't. But in every other Assassin's Creed game, you can. Oh fuck, Odyssey! You law-breaking fuckhead! I really miss Bayek. This is making me want to replay Origins again. I miss Bayek too, because right now this is not Bayek. <laughs> This is. This is not even. This is not even a gamer. This is a. This is such a non-gamer. Aya is not a gamer. I genuinely think that this uh, method is the best method in Assassin's Creed for rooftop traversal, because what there's no point in trying any other way. Worst part is you have. You. You can't be detected to continue. I want to go there to grab all of that bit. That bit that I can grab hold of. Kill him. Idiot is... We've done it this time, I think. Unless we really fuck up. Here we are. Don't forget, jumping out the highest place of the game is surviving it. <sighs> There's no point even moving in any direction but a straight line, then, obviously. Now I can disguise myself as a gamer and hope for the best. Yeah, that's a great disguise. You want to know why? Because from the front, it's fucking useless. I can get a photo mode shot now. I'm trying to get a good shot of this. I'm trying to get a good shot, but it's actually just... I'm trying to get a good shot. I'm sorry. It has to be done. I think this is a wise shot because I'm right in, I'm right in, the, in the mix of them all. You don't know where I am. And that's why I uh, put the depth of field away from it. Like this. Put the focus away from the um, the blade in the crowd. Just to be fair, in this crowd, it's more or less everyone. But okay. Look at that. How is she blending? Citizens, not just Press Y to assassinate the man. Everyone just comes in and goes, let's stab him up, boys! You too, my child. He loved it. He was like, I'm gonna stab you in the stomach. And away he went. He's just shouting in slow motion. Isn't that great? I love Origins, but some of the cutscenes are jarring.
Why did he use the feather on his eye? <laughs> you strike from the shadows. The same fate will come to all despots. Does Caesar not remember? In the end, it is impossible not to become what others believe you are. And I was a god! There is a new creed now. Yeah! Rome is eternal! She will never fall to you or your kind. Freedom is not given, Caesar. It is taken. Now that is gaming. Let's get the likes up over a hundred if we can. Requiescat in pace, Caesar. I don't understand why I said that. I guess it's Latin or something, right? So it makes a little bit of sense, but... It's also gaming. Do you know what you've done? Caesarian would have sat on the throne of Rome. Listen to the cries in the streets. They call you a dead tyrant's whore. I am still your queen. You are a queen of liars and snakes. I fought for you for five years. My people worshipped you. Apollodorus died for you, for Egypt. For Egypt? I am Egypt! Then be the ruler our people deserve. Or nothing will save you from my blade across your throat. You are the last of the pharaohs. For a little bit of context, um, Cleopatra is later killed by an assassin, a hidden one, and as you can imagine, it's not too tough to guess who. Wee, my dick is big. Wee. I think she's not Egyptian. Maybe she's Italian. She's she's. Cleopatra has a British accent, it makes no sense. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Uh, Aya is also a Greek Egyptian. So she's part Greek, part Egyptian. But she's like half Greek, not a fucking quintillionth Greek. When did she have a son? Pooped him out right at the end. God knows when. Outro time. I like this outro. We get a hidden one's layer in Memphis Fire. as well. Caesar has been assassinated. Septimius is also dead. I have founded a bureau in the middle of Rome. Yet, no one knows of our existence. Like a moon, we are the hidden ones. Do it. I believe in you. Cut the finger off. Who doesn't love a bit of pain? The irony of freedom. We are free of each other, yet it brings me no happiness. We must move forward. Remain in our tempest of blood poetry. Despite it all, we dance and they die. From darkness we have come, and in darkness Imagine cutting your finger off and still not using a hidden blade. Humans are not meant to last forever. But this creed will. The creed is the only immortal thing in the world. Wait, is Tahira's finger still there? <laughs> Finger's still there. I don't want to go home by myself. Why is the I'm dog scared. yapping? Should we take him to the bureau? No. I freeze vodka and then eat it like a popsicle. I'll take you home. Ask. 
Let nothing not grieve clever. you beyond measure, for your life is short and frozen time alcohol, will claim its not wise. But I am no longer who I was. I have renounced all love I once had. Send it to the peasant. Okay. I have renounced Aya. I have killed Aya. I am now the hidden one, known as Amunet. Subtitles ruin that reveal because you can see it from the moment she shows up on that shot. And she'll be gone in a moment because that's just a classic um, Assassin's Creed one. Then it's supposed to be a gamer. May your victories multiply. This pre-rendered cutscene looks like shit. There we go, we're no longer in a pre-rendered cutscene. You can tell what parts are and which aren't because the pre-rendered one has an odd frame rate. And then the gameplay is smooth by comparison. Assassin's Creed Origins. Ah, uh, Assassin's Papa? Creed Oranges. Jump. Don't you worry, I fucking will, son. Goodbye. <laughs> it was worth it. Now, let's have a look at Jump. This talking to the camera piece was so strange for me. Yeah, it was a... It's an ending that when I played, I thought to myself... Mm -hmm. Okay, I like what they were doing. I like what they tried to do. And then I thought the ending was... Uh, I'm pretty sure I was like that on... on when, when the first time I finished it, I was like, okay. That ending really didn't do much for me. Now... Now, the reason why I did that is because... Uh, my son told me to. I'm a delusional fuckwit. Now, the Bureau of the Hidden Ones. Let's do some Hidden Ones gaming. We are gaming. Cassandra would have survived that jump. You know, before the perk in Odyssey, you can survive any fall as well because you'll just lose the majority of your health. But you'll never die from any fall in Odyssey. You cannot die from fall damage. You just lose your health. It's odd. It's just such a fucking odd game. I don't understand. You know, haystacks better be back in Valhalla and you- Well, they weren't gone in Odyssey per se, but you better be able to just sit in them if you want to and just hide. Because you can't even hide in a haystack in, in in Odyssey. Like, in Valhalla they need to be back. They need to- you need to be able to sit in one. You can't do that. Oh god, it's so weird. Like, you stand on them, but you don't go in them. Alright, boys, it me. I don't even care who Tamatep is. Foxidas. I guess he's a cool guy. It's a little odd that Fishy is two years older than me. Well, I'm an, I'm an eternity older than you. I am. I am God. I have existed before time, and I will exist when time is done. And I'll watch the cycle repeat. This is the 60th time since the creation of reality that time has repeated itself. I know exactly what you're going to say now. Okay. Kensa, a friend of Bayek from Siwa, a good humoured fighter, had become a gladiator in the Fire Emblem Arena. Oh, it's like little bits on characters. It's almost a fierce nature unto herself. Tahira is like the rushing Nile, powerful, impossible to hold back, and always moving forward. Tahira, spelt differently, has left like, the life of the city. With its corruption and deck, okay, and has retreated to the wilderness. She is intensely devoted to the old gods. Okay, why did it spell her name wrong? Perhaps there is a healer. Can you stop mumbling, you limp? Okay. I would like to sell to you my dick. Why does he keep mumbling? I can just purchase endless tablets of knowledge. I don't know why I did that. There was no point, but there, was no, there are no, there's no point to the tablets of knowledge, and I want to bring that up. But I can buy them anyway. Fishy likes mumbling. I don't understand why he keeps mumbling. Stop mumbling. 
Fucking speak up, son. Fucking tablet of knowledge. A thousand drachm uh drachma is it drachmas drachmas for uh for fucking a thousand skill point uh sorry ability points. XP points, it's not even skill points. Right, quest time. Incoming threat. We'll see where ever no peace. No, it will not. You wanna know why? Because I'm gonna go and murder everyone in Siwa soon. I really am serious. What's serious? Serious of how AC Valamus will be. Music will be. What, what, what is serious? C E A R I U S. Is it curious or is it serious? Is it I'm serious? I'm a serious man because that, that, that is not the correct spelling of either and it's really confusing. We'll see where ever no peace. Dot by the light stream. I appreciate it, gamer. So yeah, I might do um, a stream of my um, impressions of The Last of Us Part 2 at like midnight, if it drops at midnight in the UK, I think it does, um, or whenever, but um, I don't, if, if I can't figure out spoil how I'm going to swerve spoilers, I just can't hearing that. The sunlight colour shades in Origins can never get sold, never does. Die, dick face. Of course he moved. Animals. Animals disgust me. I love animals. I love dogs. Whoa. Said he was going to kill that bird randomly. I don't understand why. But I'm not complaining. Said he just murdered that thing. If you take a shot at a random animal, Said who kills whatever's nearby to it. It's odd. On this like is Flavius. I can't even see the dislike. Because I'm on the uh, the dashboard thing. I just want the likes to go up. Let's get to 150 likes, gamers. Might have to stay up super late to see Fishy. Maybe. Maybe you will. Maybe you... If I just leave it, you reckon Senu will do bits on this on this goat? They're all goats. I don't even care what the, what the technical name is. They're all goats. That is just a goat. It's fine. It's... In my native land, there used to be a grocery store chain called Siwa. They're notorious for getting robbed so often. I can see where they took inspiration from. Because in this game, Siwa gets um, pretty much exploited by fuck lions. Not fuck lions, they don't exploit very much, just besides from each other. Stop attacking me, you fuck lion. They killed a poor, poisonous goat. And this is fine. I haven't finished Odyssey yet, but is it worth finishing? No. It's not worth finishing. It won't be relevant to the next game at all, even if it is the same modern day protagonist, which it is. But it won't be relevant remotely. Because it's just... Such a shit game that makes no sense. Do you think Valhalla will improve a, the horse riding? I don't know, but I hope so. I mean, isn't there like a wolf you can ride in that game for some odd reason? Um, or supposedly, I mean, we don't know, it's not out yet. Because, I mean, I hope that they improve and make it a bit more... A, a, a bit more thoughtful. I want more weight to it. I want to feel a bit more grounded in it. Origins and Odyssey feel far too light. None of these men will survive. So now we're gonna massacre a camp. Die, dick face. Who next? Oh, <laughs> 
Don't worry, gamers, I got this. Of course, I have to loot the commander and... I have to get out of conflict for the... F I don't have to don't have to do that when I'm looting random regular guys, but for the sake of the objective, I have to. And we've killed the captain and the commander. Uh, Jesus, my Egyptian friends. Okay, that, I'm not even going to read that. Their plan is to do bits on Egypt and hope that somebody comes along and gives them the love that they've been craving for since they were children. Which nobody will because they're goons. Where did Liverpool get its name from, by the way? Someone stuck um, a liver, in, like a human liver, in a swimming pool. I don't know. I really do not know where Liverpool got its name from. But it doesn't sound particularly pleasant, like, does it? I mean, I mean, it's in a county. I think it's is it in Mersey's, Merseyside? I think uh, I think it is. It just sounds so like rough. What editing software do you use? I use uh, Vegas, which is uh, not the, not necessarily. I guess it's not like Premiere Pro or whatever, but it works for me. I would try to learn Premiere Pro, but I, I've looked at that software and gone, this is just fucking no. I've still got to kill invaders. Bam! I love that I bashed him in the face with a shield. That made me feel so good. Why is he carrying the body? Kevin. What are you doing with that corpse, son? Some dude got stabbed in the liver while swimming in a pool. That happens almost everywhere in the UK. Not necessarily the swimming part, but... But I guess the rest I of it... Oh! Yeah, box sticking! Ah, oh, yeah, of course. I mean... They're all over the place, no doubt. One's over there. Some They're, they're all just dotted all over the show. I guess the first spot I'm going to go to is here and get those two that are nearby to one another. You going to stream The Last of Us Part 2? I might do. I'm not yet 100% decided, but I'd like, I'd like to, I guess. I mean, it's the worst that could happen. Aside from everything going wrong. I wonder if she has Viking ancestry. Well, I have icy colored eyes and relatively fair hair and amazing beard jeans. So I don't know. Whoa. Do you know Raggedy Dan? No, I don't know. Sorry, not. I mean, heard of? Yeah, sure. Don't know. They must be somewhere in this fortress. I actually despise these fortresses. You want to know why? Because they're fucking huge. There's always some dickhead. What the fuck is a bribe card? That I'm gonna I'm gonna be the first to admit that a bribe card doesn't actually make much sense. Ah oh, shit. What is a bribe cart? What 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 are you bribing them with? That is one. Now the other two. Who the fuck is that guy? Not 
time has come on the bright side. You've lived this long. Uh, Truly miraculous. That's Jabade, I got it. Time to die. What do you mean? He's dead. Oh, God damn it. Why is Fishy never read my comments? Turns out there's over a hundred people here. It's pretty difficult to read everyone's comments. Jabardi's gonna die. Again. Why is it telling me that there's a... That, okay. It's just a notification thing that... Die, dickhead. Well, this is a bit rougher in Liverpool, actually. I don't, I don't realise that there was ever a time where weather in Liverpool wasn't rough. I actually can't stand this Jabardi character. He smells. Well done, Bayek. Wrong bow. Those on we could aim and bits. But no, no, I just have to ki kill the fat one first and the rest is easy. As you know, kill Jabardi with the hidden blade and then that objective is registered as complete. But naturally, he's below me. Out the window. Oh god, I'll have to... Yeah, I just stabbed the ground and you mate. Oh, you mate, he stood up. That guy, that guy, that guy, that guy, that, that, that guy. Fuck off! Sorry, wrong guy. I'm on fire. I'm still on fire. Why has everything got to be on fire? Stop being on fire! Oh my days! <sighs> Wrong boat. I must be careful now. Hey, wait. This is the thing I don't get about RPGs, right? Sometimes non-logic just gets you in the arse. Like this guy's got a fire arrow. Like where did he get the fire arrow? Let me assassinate the right guy and then I'll then it will be registered as done. You'll try to hold out in his fortress. We'll impose a siege. Starve them out. There you go. You are dead. Now to destroy the carcass. That was Jabadi. Jabadi is deceased. Right, in a bit, lad. I like a horse that is conveniently there. What? Stop being on fire. I look at all the man that's been crucified in these ends. It's rather chill. Roll to put out the fire. I know how to play the fucking game. Did he not see me doing that when I was on fire? Oh, Jesus. I was trying to do that, but I got hit with a fire arrow on low health. Not much you can do there, because the fire still burns until you manage to roll. And besides, it's the th you have to press that button three times to roll, and holding it does nothing, so you have to just... Yeah. Believe it or not, I've played this game before. There are fire arrows in real life. Yeah, but you don't draw them from your quiver and they're immediately on fire, do you? In fact, in real life, you don't even have a quiver. <laughs> you just carry the arrows in your hand. I mean... 
to summon some water. I'll, I'll call the water gods from the sky and they'll rain down shit and piss on me. Exactly. Never understood how the end just burns. Wouldn't the whole hour just catch fire? Sorry, it's no worries. Well, I never understood is how the end just burns. Wouldn't the whole arrow set on fire? Uh, I guess it's a different material. Horse is lagging. The horse is having a bad day. Of course, it has to be in a, a highly restricted area such as this. It will never be next to an old lady and a food cart. A mental old lady and a food cart, no less. Always has to be right here in the middle of the arse end of nowhere. With a million Romans guarding it. Or are they Egyptians here? I don't know. They're dickheads, whoever they are. They stink, smell and poo on the floor. Bike can't take any falls whatsoever. But I'm kind of glad. Oh my god, it's not even that far, Bayek. He falls slowly and dies. In a bit. One more. If you're a millionaire, what's the first thing you'd do? I'd first thing I'd do is be rich. Just chill there and be rich and not. Then I'd think about clever ways to evade tax, such as donating to charities and stuff like that. I have to corrupt everything so people don't think I'm a nice man, for that is not true. I am not a nice man. Right, Canopos. Bit of gaming. Did anyone do the troll so that? I'm gonna play the DLC for Origins now. We're doing the setup quest, so yeah. I'll tell you what's a good drink to buy from the shop, right? I like this drink, though. It's an interesting drink. It's called Schlur. It's just an odd. It's just an odd like drink, and it's pretty nice. Did you YouTube full time? Sorry for asking again. It's no worries. I guess I do at the moment. Beats doing nothing full time at the moment, I think. But no, right now this is this is my um this is my occup this is my current occupation, I guess. Entertaining you guys, making the best content I possibly can, dedicating all my all my time to doing this. Schlur, there you go. It's got a, it's got a H. It's got a, has it got a C in it somewhere? Schlur. Uh, no, it doesn't. It doesn't have a, it doesn't have a C in it. It's just. S H L O E R. Sorry, you are correct. Schlur. 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 Do, do enjoy a bit of Schlur. It is a lovely drink. Oh god, I'm sweating in here. My room gets really hot, and for soundproofing reasons, I can't have the window open, and my fan makes far too much noise. But let me know if you can hear this, guys. Actually. I can barely hear that, but if you can, let me know, because, I mean, it's nice and pleasant, but it's making a fucking massive noise. I can't hear it through my headphones, but it's not pleasant at all. You can hear that, though, can't you? Yeah. Hmm. See? I have to, I have to burn for your enjoyment. It is loud. We don't mind. Well, I have to, but well, I... I can't stomach watching this back knowing that there's sound, there's alien sound like that, but you know, not, not, not coming from the game or my voice, anything else besides than that, maybe the buttons every now and then is too much, you know, like, it's just horrible, it's horrible to listen to, I hate listening to fans through microphones, oh my god, I got knocked off my horse, talk about a gaming moment, he just got an arrow in the face, Meet Otis in Alexandria. 
Is that the fucking cow from Barnyard? Sounds like a lawnmower. There's got to be something stuck in it, because it's not supposed to make that noise. It's not supposed to make that noise, see? It's mo meant to be smoother than that. Bit more like that. But whatever, I can't I can't get it working because it's just too too loud. Le hates listening to fans, I do hate us. I not that kind of fan. I don't have I don't have fans, I have viewers. I'm not I'm not famous. I don't think I'll I don't think I ever want to be famous. I have viewers. I don't there's no there's no like barrier between between us that's, that means that you're fanatic about me. I hope I hope not anyway. I just I, I just rather, you know, be a bit more chill. I don't mind listening to you guys because in the in the chat you make no noise. I mean if you're all in a room together, Jesus Christ, I'd I'd probably like if everyone who watches my content was in a room together, I wouldn't be able to even hear myself think, I'm sure. So no, I wouldn't enjoy listening to that. But no, but I'm on about fans that make air in that, you know. <laughs> not you guys. What I'm trying to say is, in my own twisted way, is I can't stand listening to noises that aren't you aren't supposed to hear when watching things back like videos or things they have to be to a quality they have to be to an acceptable quality hearing a fan in the background is just fucking disgusting it's horrible <laughs> your sacrifice is appreciated fish you love your content by the way it's no sacrifice i'm enjoy I, I guess i'm enjoying gaming it's not too it's not too hot in here really it's just sweaty it's humid and um, there's no air conditioning or anything Fishes found this chatting breeze, exactly. What are all these I remember I used to here? knock out civilians and burn them in Origins. To be fair, I agree. Well, I too would burn civilians and knock them out and kill. What has happened here? Oh god, dick face. And his big dick face. Where's the next? Oh my god, that's Otis. Oh, I fear it is Otis. This man is gonna hit me in the back. No, he's not. I did okay. Wearing the robes of a scribe. Ah, it is indeed Otis. Poor man. Signs of torture. Someone tried to make him talk. Imagine the success of that. Investigate Otis's house. Can't wait to find some porn. This is Otis's blood. He tried to flee. Okay. How slow did that bar fill up? Did you not hear me killing your mates downstairs, pal? <laughs> Because maybe, maybe, maybe listen for your cue. It's not like these walls are particularly soundproof. They were determined to leave no witnesses. I don't even know who this man is. I'm standing over him. He was attacked in his sleep. That's where Otis sleeps, is it? Don't know, me. This jar has something in it. Imagine if it's a snake. Did not. Imagine Must if it... important. How did he know that there's something in it? Otis knows. I hope you won't have to read this, because if you do, it means I'm probably dead. Probably. Give yourself a bit of credit there. I'm in too deep and I've compromised myself. I do believe I found what this... Okay. You did fine work to gather this information, Otis. As you traverse the Duat, I swear to you, if I get the chance, I will make certain this General Rufio pays. Instead of going, I will make certain this General Rufio pays, he goes, you know what? What he's saying is if I have the chance, so it's like, what he's saying is, I don't necessarily have the time to do so now, but I will, I promise, make sure that General Rufio pays. You know what I mean? Come on, a bit more conviction, you know what you're setting up there. Love Alfred in The Last Kingdom. The Last Kingdom's a good series to watch if you want to have, a, like, a, a rough idea of what they're going to probably wind up going for with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Like, if you want to get excited for Assassin's Creed Valhalla, watch that. It is it is that setting. I know some people go, Vikings better, and other people go, The Last Kingdom better, and it's at an exact 50-50 split between people who prefer Vikings and people who prefer The Last Kingdom. And I don't give a fuck about that stuff. I watched a bit of Vikings, and it's a bit more general. Um... And what and what it addresses. The Last Kingdom is a very, very concentrated story, more or less, from the from the get go. 
Um, but if, if you want to if you want to watch something that's not necessarily going to give you an idea of what the game's going to be like, but if you want to watch, I guess a tone. I guess it'll probably capture the tone quite well. Um, and if you want to get yourself excited, that's a show to watch. And of course, then there's Vikings, which I haven't watched too much of, uh, but I'm going to watch some of that Excuse myself. Me. I'm looking for watch a man both. named Bayek. People have been watching I'm many days. To give you passage to the Sinai. I ha I definitely need to go to the Sinai. Me, chill with my gamers. By it, I cannot convey the sorrow with which I write to you. The Sinai is in revolt against the Romans. Two hidden ones have been killed in a massacre. I am solely responsible. I am the one who trained them. I am struggling to keep the hidden ones together, and have allied with the rebel leader Gamilad. I need your wise counsel, dear friend. Sorry, what's uh, shit writing and shit storytelling? These days I've randomly been addicted to Turkish shows. I don't get that one, but okay. This guy's singing about Bayek. Night, the Sinai sleeps exhausted with grief. Actually, no, that's the, that's, that's the other one, isn't it? That's... filled with ashes, we weep tears. That's the oh, curse of the pharaohs, right? Who or is it here? Deliver us from despair. <laughs> Our hero moves with the mist, as silent as the sea, delivering death, unknown, unseen, ever unforgiving. Listen. Oh, it's Let here. Let me tell you of him, the legend of Siwa, the shadow who is Bayek. Bayek, Bayek, Bayek. Bayek. And Bayek just walks past that. Like, like okay. quite the man. Fair enough. <laughs> Good old Bayek. He's a good guy. I feel like they should have emphasized that part a bit more as well. Like, if you're going to make Bayek something of a legend to these people, like a like a ghostly thing, then they need to. I think I think they need to do a little bit of gaming. If you get what I mean. I need to find the hideout. It should be visible from a height. Find, reach, sorry, find and reach the Hidden Ones Bureau. How many districts do we have here? We have the Arisen, Arsino Gnome, the Red Sea, the the Klisma Gnome, uh, Madiama Gnome. These are all very strange names for gnomes. Now, let's continue. I don't even need to... Go to the viewpoint, we're going to do it anyway, purely for having the viewpoint done. The Hidden Ones DLC is a good time. Gamer, okay, sorry for a bit, not being here in the start. I had to go do a gamer shower. That's, that's a gaming shower, I'm sure. You don't need to make, you don't need to excuse yourself, man. It's all right. It's all good that you're, uh, it's good that you're here at, uh, at all, really. I'm just glad to have a moderator active, if you get me. That's not even the fucking viewpoint shit. I want to shit on the floor. Sorry, sometimes you just have to say something really, really odd. And that is the kind of man that I am. I like the Hidden Ones DLC. I think it's a good DLC. The Hidden Ones and Curse of the Pharaohs are actually both really proper dandy. This all makes a shameless um, Star Wars reference. And I think it's like literally the only Easter egg that anyone's ever talked about from this DLC. <laughs> but I, it's over, Bayek. I have the high ground. Of course. Any tips about growing a beard? Um, well, I ah, guess. There it is. I, I, I guess look after yourself. Uh, make sure you eat well and plenty and healthily. Um. Keep your face kind of clean. The entrance is closed. 
There must be another way. Why have I gotten And all that gaming? Um and be patient with it, you know? So who can help you find a secret entrance? That's not a secret entrance really, but that is. I've already got blood on my new garb, which I've been I've had equipped for the entire playthrough. This is the first time I'm supposed to see Bayek in these robes. And it's already bloodied. What an odd way in. This is it. Legatus Tacitus. Ah. Thomas the poop at face. Dear to hear her, your mum smells. And it I'm off, got stuff to do off. Don't shave. Well, you've got to sometimes. It's good for the face. And also, it doesn't necessarily make the, the beard grow back thicker. But it does sometimes Such grow back loss faster. Of life. To hear her. Oh, Bayek, thank the gods you have come. Your message was urgent. These are the swords of two hidden ones I recruited, killed in a massacre. They will be remembered as martyrs to the cause. This is Gamilat, leader of the Nabatean rebels. What happened? We retreated through the village. The Romans pursued us in a fury and took their anger out on the villagers. Gamalat is a nice-looking man men, for this women. for this game, graphically the speaking. Tried to stop it and were killed. They understood the risks. I assigned them to help the rebels. Tahira, what has been done cannot be undone. I want a beard like Kratos. The hidden ones have no place in battles, but we can help the rebellion by eliminating the Roman leader, General Rufio. But he is in Rome. Rufio has three lieutenants here in the Sinai. These three men will die. Let's get to it. I love listing the three men that must die. I am indebted to you. We do this for the people, Gamilat. Yes, the people. The people and I are one and the same. <laughs> Look at this yeah, map of dick. Tell you anything you need to know. Where the slaves die, cool. Well, see, instead of saying multiple quests added and making you have to suffer going through the menu, give some good ideas. Now, I have a question. Why is the map like this here? But like this here? I guess it's, um... The, these lot were doing their gaming bits, I guess. I don't know. North is left. Why is north that way? I guess it's detail to go further across like that. Fair enough. That's really awkward. Osokon has been missing for two weeks. He is the shadow tasked with surveying the quarry. Yet the shadow became lost. It may be too late for Osokon. He went to a merchant ship at the dock several days ago, and that place is crawling with the Romans. Well, how in December, is it? His passion for the people and the hidden ones knew no bounds. I would die for him. I will find this Osokon. I should go meet Tahira about the quarry. Look at this. Proper gaming. Don't forget to leave a like on the stream, share with your friends, hit subscribe if you're new. That would all be wonderfully fantastic and I'd really appreciate the gaming. Horizontal map it beats. I guess so. Ah, uh, Bayek. It is time to dispose of Rufio's lieutenant. Tacito often comes out to roost atop the quarry. He 
is a brutal overseer. He makes an example of his workers every day. Okay. Uh, Tacito. So I suppose that's Ruth. Is that Rufio's lieutenant then? I guess so. Now that was cool. Oh, now that was. Now that was cool. Okay. I have absolutely smashed that. God damn it, Tasha. What do you mean? I'm a hidden one. What do you mean? It wasn't exactly a spectacle before. Why am I on fire? I was doing the rolling thing, and I was still on fire. Right, well, now I'm this way. Oh shit. Nearly. There we go. an odd man. I bought Spider-Man PS4 a few days ago, but I find it pretty me mediocre, to be honest. Fair enough. He's already dead, you dickhead. Stop with the bloody fire arrows, you dickhead. Everyone has to have fire arrows now. That's just the logic of it. Some, for some reason, while, while being detected, you can't draw your bow all the way back. I don't understand. 
That's one of the things that annoy me about slow motion, like interrupting gameplay just to tell you you've been detected. It takes A far too long and just feels tedious and pisses you off. I get it. I can attack things. Stop telling me I can I'm going to burn to death. For the love of God. What is Tahira randomly doing here? Why don't you make a video on your favourite Assassin's Creed cinematic trailer? Because I can't think of a topic more boring, that's why. <laughs> I can't genuinely think of a topic that I'd rather talk about less. Like, I don't, I'd never watch a video about somebody tell, telling me about their favourite cinematic trailer for Assassin's Creed. I'd never watch that video, so why would I make it? Revelations is the best one, yes, but I mean, I'd still not make that video. Ready. I fear more Romans are on the horizon. Tacito has a larger force than this. I am certain of it. If we cut down my the ears are sweating. We may cause a rebellion, which will bring more good to Sinai. That's a good attitude. Yeah, if I now that's that's the thing you got to ask yourself when you make videos. Would I watch this? And if the answer is no, then the the answer is don't make it. Those if you're not because if you don't if you wouldn't watch it, you don't enjoy making it. Because if it's not something that you'd happily sit down and watch, then what's the point? Let the fire of our oppressors. Doesn't mean you have to watch your own videos, it's just if I were not me, would I watch this? Making a big offering for Anubis. Oh god, of course he has re of course they have reinforcements. This is a classic moment. Let us retake the quarry. 
fine. There we go. It's all. It's all gaming when you are a cheese. Yes, Bayek. You are still the fine warrior I knew. As are you, Tahira. You still fight with Zobek. Ensure this quarry remains in good hands. I'm poo on the floor in that. Will be hard. Rufio will send more centurions, and there are still slaves inside the quarry who need to be liberated. Ah, Tahira slave liberation. Is your you work for Gamelot? He told us of the hidden ones. Great shadowy heroes. No one works for the hidden ones. Well, thank you for defending us. If I see you. Why is the dog barking again? What the fuck I is he barking for? It. We get a lot of experience from that stuff. Excuse me. I want to get to the pause menu, please. Thank you. The Ballad of Simut and Gerth and Gertha. Who are you? Shadow of the South. Hang on, I want that viewpoint. That's where I want to go. Oh. That did not that that you know input denied notification thing. That sound is really pleasant. Because it's from the old league games as well. I like this viewpoint. <laughs> Does Curse of the Pharaohs come before or after the Hidden Ones? I think it's before, but it's also they all they they, they also make zero. It also makes zero sense in the game. Like it says it's before, but it also says it's up, says it's after it, so elsewhere. It's just. Uh, I think it's meant to be before, but I think they intended for it to be after, and it just wound up accidentally being before, due to an oversight. Um, so it doesn't matter though. It's gaming. What's going on in the chat in Discord? Who the fuck? You know what? I'm just gonna close Discord altogether. I go in and uh, Jamie is cam girl Stacy all of a sudden, and I think to myself, well, I don't need to be here for a minute. I've been watching for over an hour. That's pretty cool. I've been streaming for over an hour too. I guess we're killing this man, Shadow of the South. He's technically not a Fire Lake, right? Wait, is he a Fire Lake? A Shadow of the Scarab. Oh yeah, that's what he is. He's not a Fire Lake, but he's a... He's a Fire Lake mechanic. I mean that's that's warfare, right? We just did bits on the man, and he is dead. Majama gnome. Assassinate the shadows of the scarab. Love to. That was easy. I looked at his health, and it only had one like dividing spot on it, and I thought, yeah, this is not going to be difficult. Look at that! Isn't that charming? There we go. Proper fire on that. Right. 
And if I want to look at it, I can just look at it there. See? Beautiful. Fucking hippos. Naturally. My horse is useless. Kill it, hippos. I am not surprised that they don't want the horse dead too. That horse could make friends with Hitler. It's just a hippo scrapping a hyena out here and fuck. Will they break the DLC up for Valhalla? I can honestly. I hope not. I hope they just release the full DLC at once, as opposed to, like, in parts. Because Odyssey's DLC, I'm going to be honest with you, Odyssey's DLC being broken down into parts was like, well, you have to wait for three, like, for, like, a, like six weeks between each episode of the DLCs, and they weren't worth waiting for. They weren't good. They weren't even remotely good. I don't understand. But they're actually doing really bad traversal. The gameplay is a bit clunky, I guess. Oh, this is this must be a place where I took a, a photo. On oh my god, I took I took that on my on my other PC and look at how lovely it looks. Holy crap, that is a nice shot. You know what? Oh, that is lovely. Look at that. Tell me that's not a beautiful shot. Must have scanned and do the sleep spy gamers. Take it easy, Ben. This one, I don't know, this one doesn't, oh, where, no, this, there. As lovely as that is, that is just the loveliest shot there. Uh, what's this one here that I've done? I'll never look at some of my photos, actually. You know what, I didn't do too badly with some of these. Yeah, okay, I'm going to that one wasn't the best. Well, it's fine. Yeah, I like that one a lot. That's a good shot. It's not a bad shot. It's adequate. What the fuck? Ah. It's a gamer. I'm quite good at this screenshot business these days. I mean, oh, look at that. Charming. I'm going down memory lane looking at some of these screenshots because these are from my first playthrough of this DLC. Look at that! Love Fishy Ragnar Odyssey is always great. There's nothing good to say about it and people insist on bringing it up. And also, it's rele I guess it's relevant to talking about Assassin's Creed these days. Hang on, shit. No map. All, all stuff. Yes, What's that. I want to go over there because it's a thing. A deed of deed. Does Origins have multiplayer? No. It is. It's fully single player. No Assassin's Creed game since. Um, well, Syndicate onwards don't have multiplayer. They still have online features because obviously. They've got to find a way to put microtransactions in there, but none of them have multiplayer, just online services. Why did you tag AC Odyssey if it's... Did I tag it? Did I tag Odyssey and not Origins? Fuck! Of course I did. Right, hang on. I didn't. I didn't even realise. I must have been thinking about it. I must. I'm sorry. I'm gonna. I'm gonna remove. I'm gonna remove that and change it to Origins because that's what I intended for that to be. Sorry about that. I didn't realise that that's what I'd done. I thought I'd put Origins in there. Jesus, that's my own fault. Yep. No worries. That's all. It's all fixed now. It should say Origins, not Odyssey, because Jesus, that shouldn't have been a thing. Um. Now I've got an ad. I've refreshed the stream and I've got an ad for. Um, a razor dedicated to your bollocks and 
can't imagine a thing that I can't imagine any better ad. Tagged it. Well, I, I was trying to tag Origins and I must have thought Odyssey and typed Odyssey instead. I apologize. Manscaped. Exactly. Let's get the 200 likes. Let's get them likes up. Let's get all them likes up. That'd be fantastic. Let's get to a, a, a huge, hefty number, shall we? Better, better than getting mobile game ads. No, oh, no, Manscaped is a good company. I recommend it. I mean, never used that company, I guess. Anyone gonna watch that EA play? Uh, maybe. I mean, depends on whether or not The Last of Us Part Two launches at midnight in the UK, because that's the exact time that EA play is supposed to start. And honestly, if those two things happen at the same time, there's only one of those things that I can live without. And well, actually, I can live without both. But my point is. If I were to choose to live without one of them, it would be the EA Play event. I'd love a Mass Effect remaster announcement, but I just doubt it'll happen. Hang on a second. Sorry about that, everybody. My brother's PC arrived. Uh, me and my um, mum, we helped my brother. Um, we came up with a. Uh, we, we, tried, we had to. We had to help him, you know, sort out a custom build for his PC, and we. We did get it sorted. I just. Uh, yeah, no, it arrived today, um, and I got my brother for his birthday some RAM for his. Uh, for his PC to to get 32 gigs in there to, to use up all four DIMM slots, and. And it's quite simple, really. Our PC's expensive, oh yeah. They are. They're a little bit... Let's not talk about The Last of Us at all. A, it's not relevant to Assassin's Creed, and B, you know, people, some dickhead will just come in and chat. And drivel that nobody wants. I'm only going to be live for another probably like five minutes anyway. Um, might actually just head to Clisma Quarry and leave it here, um, because A, it's getting hot in this room, B, you've been up for two hours anyway, and I'm, I'm not even doing anything at this point. You don't need 32 gigs, 16 max. Don't insult my intelligence, for one, because, trust me, future proofing. Um, and also, I know what I'm doing. I've got 64 gigs in this thing, and believe me, sometimes that doesn't feel like enough. Um, when you're streaming like this, I mean, I don't know, it's just a little bit more freedom to work with. See, also, my reason why to go with more than 16 gigs is 8 gigabytes is no longer enough, and RAM can fail. If one stick fails, you're on 8 gigabytes. If you have four sticks of 8, though, you have 24, and that's still more than enough. Logical, it's not even that expensive these days. It costs an extra 70 quid. It's not that bad. Don't worry about it. Besides, if you have two extra RAM slots, use them. Most most games will run fine on eight. Yeah, but when you close the game, it's a fucking disaster. Um, trust me, I'm, I'm, I'm using my brain here. It's a good it's a good machine, and the reason why there's so much RAM is because you can. RAM, random access memory. Anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna wrap it up now. So take it easy, everybody. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, share the channel with your friends and all that wonderful stuff. That would be fantastic. Um, 
and with any luck i'll catch you all very soon with another video or stream at some point but before we go i need to thank the pe the uh the, the don't super chat is isak marnie and james rostron and of course all the lovely patrons as well if you want to join these these gamers then there's a uh, link in the description you can check it out for yourself but um whether or not you think it's worth it, it's completely up to you i won't force you but no it's one of those ones anyway i'll catch you all very soon but yeah until next time it is goodbye